Well, 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 guys, welcome back to another video. Now, y'all, it is that time of year. We are going firework shopping. Y'all know every year we go and buy fireworks, we blow them up, we do videos on buying fireworks, how to buy fireworks the smart ways, ways that'll save you more money. The past, like, two years in a row, we've done fireworks videos where it was a full budget box with just an assortment of different pyro. So, yeah, we are going to get a budget box made or built or whatever, and it is only going to include aerial stuff and primarily only including artillery shells maybe there will be canister shells maybe there will be ball shells or even little mini shells it really just depends but this box only going to be artillery shell in the pyrotechnic world artillery shells are my personal favorite I like them more than cakes than Roman candles than sparklers than fountains than anything else like that artillery shells are cool because you can kind of customize them your own way you can make your show a little bit more detailed so for those of you who also like artillery shells we have got an entire $200 budget list now this list was kind of constructed in a way that will hopefully save you more money for example with the canister shells here we are being pretty vague because we don't want them to really know how many or how little we want I want them to kind of decide like okay well this box has got enough space for six or twelve canister shells so let me put them in the box and then with this stuff here we got a little bit more specific we said two or more boxes of ball shells of course ball shells are a little bit cheaper but are pretty fun and can sometimes be just as good as some canister shells and I will let you guys decide in the comments is it worth the $200 budget? We're going to head on inside to this fireworks store, take a look at the stuff they have to offer, buy some stuff for myself and for another video, and then of course, get our $200 budget box built. Let's go. Alrighty guys, so we have just dropped off our budget box paper over there and the kit, if you will, the budget box is being pieced together. While it's being pieced together, I'm just going to kind of shop around for some of my personal items and then once it is ready to go, I'll check it out. Okay, I already like where this is starting and we've got a huge pack of canister shells that is definitely above and beyond what I was expecting once again We'll go over this in better detail too when we get home along with all of our other pyro These are super cool the black cat six shots. Those are super awesome I would highly suggest getting a kit like this done that way you can just get all the artillery shells you need for your show and with all of this stuff here coming over to the register perfectly at if it'll focus, if it'll focus. 198.48. That was nailed so evenly. Um, I'm actually pretty surprised. Good, good job, sir. We made it. And then we've got all this other stuff we're gonna add on to it. Get our entire subtotal. Holy smokes. Getting it loaded up. Canister shells for days. 500 gram cakes right there. Okay, we were taking a look at this big fella here. And I think we're gonna go ahead and add that to the cart as kind of our grand finale piece for our show. I was watching the video and it looked pretty insane. So we'll take this guy, get it home, shoot it off later and see what it looks like in real life. Alrighty, we are currently loading up our $700 in fireworks into the truck here. Once we get home, we'll take a closer look at our budget box, see what kind of deal we got, see what kind of products we got. I can already tell you, I am super excited about this entire 24 pack of canister shells. I was not expecting a full 24 pack in my budget box, but once again, we'll take a closer look when we get home. Alrighty guys, we are back home and we're gonna take a quick look through what we've got. And I'm gonna let you guys decide down in the comments, was this worth $200? So first off, if I can kind of pick it up, this is a heavier box. In our $200 artillery shell kit, we've got the barely legal lock and load, whatever you want to call it. This is a 24 pack of canister shells. Once again, a 24 pack. So we've got six, 12, 18, and 24 shells. I believe those are five inch shells. So those should be pretty decent in size. Then moving on into this bag full of artillery shells. We'll just take this one out. This is our next biggest box. Also a little bit of weight to this guy. We've got 12 pack of ball shells. These are called bullet bombs. I'm not sure how well these perform, but they look like they're gonna do a pretty good job. They're packaged really nicely and they have a pretty good bit of weight on them. 
So yeah, we got that pack of bullet bombs as well. So far we're at 24 plus the 12 shots there. So altogether 36 breaks. We're at 36 breaks and we still got a little bit more. We've got the Black Hat 6 shot. It's a pretty just classic ball shell assortment. Six more breaks to add on to the 30 something that we already had. Super excited to try this little guy out as well. And wait, there are more shells. Then we've got another pack, another pack. And these two are somewhat similar. These are festival balls and artillery shells. So these should be pretty cool. And it's another six and six. So we got six here, six here, six here, 12 there and 24 there. These should be lots of fun to try out. These are good for just kind of basically getting started. These are not nearly as powerful as canister shells, but they make great fillers for your show. And last, but most certainly not least, in the very bottom here, the little guy. This is the Red Rascals Super Loud. So I guess these are like, um, they're like little mini salutes. I'm gonna assume that's what these guys are. I love these things because you can literally light them on the ground and they pop so loud. For $200 in artillery shells, is that worth it? Remember, the cost also for things this year is a little bit more expensive than what the cost of things were last year. Regardless guys, I am super excited to try all of these fireworks out for New Year's Day and New Year's Eve. This should be loads of fun. And once again, let me know, was it worth $200? So we asked for a number of different things, a number of different items, um, and I think just about everything we included was there. Some of the stuff on the list they may not have even had in stock, but I think we got a pretty good amount compared to what we are looking for. And then over here, this whole stack is other fireworks from a later haul. So if y'all think I should make a fireworks stash video on all of this stuff, let me know down in the comments. And without further ado, guys, that is it for today's firework video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. You guys know the drill. And hey, happy new year, guys. And I will see you all in the next one. Peace!